Okay, class, let's get started with our writing section. Here's our first sentence. Let's listen and repeat. Tom's family is in the store. Three, two, one. Tom's family is in the store. Yes, Tom's family is in the store. Vivian, who is in the store? Tom's family. Tom's family is in the store. That's a who. So let's take in our books, underline Tom's family, and at the top, write who, W-H-O. Tom's family is in the store. Who is in the store? Okay. Tom's family is where, Vivian? In the store. In the store. Very good. Tom's family is where? They're in the store. So in the store, let's underline, that's a where. So our pattern today is who is where? Three, two, one. Who is where? Very good. Who is where? Tom's family is in the store. Together. Who is where? Tom's family is in the store. Very good. Let's match and fill in the sentences. One more time. Who is in the store? Who is in the store? Yeah. Is it Tom's family? Yes. Yes. Tom's family is in the store. Vivian, what goes here do you think? Tom's family blank in the store? Is in the store. Is in the store. Very good. And Tom's family is where? In the store. In the store. Tom's family is in the store. Who is where? All right, let's try okay, again. Let's go to our next page, class. So today we have two patterns. Our first pattern, can you remember? It's who is, what's the last part? Uh, where. Yes, where. Who is where? Everyone, let's write this at the top of our practice book. Who is where? Very good. For one apple, who can tell me the second pattern? Okay, Vivian. Um, who gets what? Very good, Vivian teacher. Who gets what? We have who is where and who gets what. Let's repeat that. Three, two, one. Who is where and who gets what? Okay, so let's use those sentences, those patterns, to make some new sentences using these words at the top. Our first word is pencils. Three, two, one. Pencil. Yeah, pencils. So, is that a what or a who? Do we say, hello pencils, nice to meet you pencils? No, it's not a who, so it's a what. Very good, Vivian. Let's write what on top of pencils. Our next word is in the car. When we have in the blank, what kind of word is that? Um, where. Where, very good, right, where. Let's skip is, and our last one is my dad. Okay, so that's going to be either a who or a what. But we say, hello, my dad. My dad is very kind. So my dad is a person. What do you think? Is it a who or a where? Who. Very good. My dad is a who. Let's write who. W-H-O at the top. We have a what, a where, is, and then who. Okay, so number one. Let's read it. My grandfather is, and go ahead and just say blank for the line, Vivian. Three, two, one. My grandfather is blank. My grandfather is blank. Okay, we have the word is here. Let's look at our patterns. Who is where? Who gets what? Is this going to be pattern one or two, Vivian? One. Yes, the word is, pattern one. Who is where? So my grandfather is the who. Let's write who on top of my grandfather. So now we need what? What goes in the blank? Where. Where. Let's look at our words here. Can you find a where, Vivian? In the car. In the car. My grandfather is in the car. And let's write where on top of in the car. Very good. Who is where? My grandfather is in the car. Okay, let's try number two. All right, let's move on. So. I want to make new sentences, this time using our beautiful pictures over here. But first, we have four words at the bottom. What's this first word, Vivian? Can you read it? Mom. Mom. Very good. So, mom. 
Is that a who or a what? A who. Who, very good. Let's write who on top of mom. The next word is in the kitchen. What kind of word is that? In the blank is a? Where. Very good. Let's write where. Our next word is get. And our last one is books. What kind of word is books? Do you ever say hello books? Nice to meet you books? No. No. So books is a? What. Very good. It's a what. Alright, so let's make our sentences using these words. Our first pattern. What was our first pattern on the last page, Vivian? Who? Who? Is. Is. Where. Very good. Who is where. So we need a who and a where. Let's look at our picture and see if we can find one who and one where. Do you see any people here? Yeah. Yeah, there's a who right here. Who is that? Look at your words at the bottom of the page. Is there a who at the bottom? Yeah. What does it say? Mom. Very good. Our who is mom. Okay. We also need a where. Where is mom? Is she in the school bag? No. No. What's the word at the bottom? What's the where? In the kitchen. In the kitchen. Very good. Mom is in the kitchen. And so we have a who and a where. What goes in the middle? What are we missing? Is. Is. Mom is in the kitchen. Who is where? Mom is in the kitchen. Let's just say, who is where? Mom is in the kitchen. Three, two, one. Mom is in the kitchen. Very good. Let's go ahead and write that in your books. Very good. Let's see what we write. Perfect. All right, let's move on to the next one. All right, last page, class, let's go. So, we have two patterns again. What are the two patterns? What's the first pattern, Vivian? Who? Who is where? Very good. Who is where? Let's write that at the top of our book. All right, and the second pattern. This time, Vivian. Who gets what? Who gets what? Very good. Who gets what? And who is where? So, we need who's, where's, and what's. Let's try to find the first who for who is where, but this time, only one who. So not many people, only one person. Vivian, in all these words, can you find just one person? Your teacher. Very good. Your teacher, everyone. Let's circle your teacher. And up here, let's circle who in pattern number one. That way we know circle is the who. Okay? Now, what else do we need in our pattern, Vivian? Where. Yes, we need a where. Hmm, can you find any wheres here, Vivian? Um, in the room. In the room is a where. Very good. This time, let's put a box around in the room. Go ahead, in your books. And I'm going to put a box here around the word where. Go ahead and do that. So now we know who is where is our pattern. What's our who? Your teacher. And our where? In the room. Your teacher is in the room. Let's go ahead and try that. Your teacher, teacher is in the room. Let's see. Very good. Your teacher is in the room. Good job, Vivian. Let's move on. Okay, class, let's finish up. We need to make two of our own sentences using our own words. Okay, Vivian, so what is our first pattern? Who, who is, is where? Where, very good. Who is where? Three, two, one. Who is where? All right, and our second pattern, Vivian, is? Who gets what? Who? Gets what? Very good. Those are our two patterns. So let's start with the first one. We need a who and a where. Let's see, what are some who's? So who's can be people or they can be animals. Let's do one who. We can do Vivian. Vivian is a who. What is another who, another person or animal? Any ideas, Vivian? Children. Children. Okay, children is okay, but children is many people. 
Today we want just one person because it's is. So just one person. Uh, teacher. Teacher, very good. Teacher is one person. We could put teacher. It could also be an animal. We could put the snake. Okay, the snake is. And then we need where. Okay, what are some wares? Wares are in the blank. We have in the store, in the car. Let's see, I'm going to try in the park. Okay, can you try Vivian? What's another where? In the... Uh, classroom. Ah, uh, very good. In the classroom. I'm going to put in the classroom. Very good. Okay, so we have who is where, some examples, Vivian is in the park. I want you to make your own sentence down here. The blank is a who, then put is, and another blank for the where. Okay, go ahead and try the first sentence now.